Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm so excited to be sitting here and doing this video because it has been forever since I've been able to do a sit down video. With Luca and Leo being three and four years old, it's really hard to be able to sit, film these videos because they're always either fighting, screaming, the TV's on, so it's really hard to get a quiet time to do these videos, but today I have childcare. They're at the park with their aunt, so we're fine. And I get to do this. So today I'm gonna to be doing one of my favorite videos to make, which is an Amazon travel haul video. I love Amazon, I love shopping on Amazon, I love looking at people's storefronts and seeing what they have. It's just one of my favorite things to do, so it's a problem sometimes. But I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some of the items that I think are worth buying on Amazon. I've had some of these for a few months. Some of these are a little bit newer to me. But if you're new to my channel, my name is Allie and I'm an Orlando-based flight attendant and I vlog about my life as a mom, as a flight attendant, how I balance it all. And I sprinkle a little bit of lifestyle, a little bit of everything. So if you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe and click on your notification so you never miss a video. Also, make sure to follow me over on TikTok and Instagram. I tend to post there pretty much daily. So when I'm not here, you can find me there. All right, the first thing I'm gonna talk about is kind of random, but they are these deodorant wipes. The ones that I would normally get are now like discontinued or something, but I found these that are a good alternative. These are aluminum free, paraben free, sulfate free. And in this box, you get a bunch of these little towelettes. They look a little weird, I know, having them <laughs> in your bag, but you pretty much just use this to wipe your underarms and they're good to have, not just for us as flight attendants to kind of freshen up after a long day of flying or in between flights, but also in case you're flying overseas or you have a long day of flying and traveling, you can go to the bathroom and freshen up a little bit if you feel like you're a little stinky or just wanna feel better. These are good and they smell minty so they also feel very refreshing. It controls sweat, it controls odors, and you get so many of these in that box. So I make sure to have some in my car, in my suitcase, in my work tote. I recommend them, they're great. And I guess since we're talking about staying clean, I'm gonna show you guys this travel toothbrush that I got. This is actually a Sonicare, I believe. I, th I think that's the kind of brush it is, but I got this on Amazon for, I believe, $40. So it's a little bit pricey for a travel toothbrush, but it is electric. So you do have to charge it at home, just like you would the ones that you would normally have on your vanity, on your uh, bathroom sink but they have plenty of colors. I like the, the fact that it comes with the case and not just a little thing to cover the brush head. I've had it for about five months now and I feel like it's done a really good job at holding up. I've only had to charge it once. So I think because I only take it on my flight attendant trips, the battery lasts me a lot longer. It feels like it's really good quality. It's lasted me a while, like I said, and then you can just put it in your toiletry bag. It doesn't take up a lot of space. Okay, this next one, if you watch my reels or TikToks, or maybe even some of my morning routines here on YouTube, you know that I like to use an ice roller in the morning. I wake up at four o'clock in the morning every single day so I can go to the gym. And having an ice roller first thing in the morning when I come downstairs is just so refreshing. It wakes me up, it helps with puffiness, and it's just such a nice little treat and routine to have in the morning. So when I'm traveling for work, I don't have that ice roller with me, so I kind of miss it. And I found this travel one that's a two-sided one. Use, I, th this side can be used for your body. And then there's this side right here that's really good for your face and your cheekbones and all that. So I like to put this in my bag and put it in the fridge or freezer if there's one in the hotel room and just use this first thing in the morning. Sometimes we have to wake up around two o'clock in the morning as flight attendants just because we have early shows. So it's nice to be able to have this with me and have a little bit of home with me when I'm traveling. And speaking of skincare, this is so extra to have, but it's so convenient and it's genius. I have a whole bag of these spa wristbands that you just put on your wrist like this and it just makes washing your face so much nicer and less messy. Have you ever had those times when you're washing your face and you have water dripping all over, it gets down to your sleeves, your pajamas and all that? So I found these on Amazon and I have a pair in my toiletry bag and one in my bathroom so that I'm able to use them every time I wash my face. And it's just so nice to have these little towels here. They're easy to travel with, they don't take up a lot of room and you can use these whether you're traveling for leisure, you're going to a hotel, it doesn't matter. You can have these with you at all times. So in here, there are 10 toothpicks and all you do is just pull this up like this and then you get one of these that comes out so you can have them to floss your teeth 
whether you're on the plane or in the hotel room it's double-sided so it comes out on either side and i like the fact that they're in this little case because sometimes you get them in those little bags and those bags like open up and then i feel like dirt gets in them or dust or whatever so i like the fact that this comes in a case to protect them and keep them clean and safe and they don't fall out which is really nice unless the only the only way they come out is if you push this button right here again if you follow me on instagram you know that my family and i have a matcha business that we are in the process of starting so i have been traveling with a travel kettle so that i can prepare my hot water when i'm in the hotel room so this is collapsible which is so cool because it doesn't take up any room whatsoever you put your hot water in, or you put water in here plug it in you turn it on and then your water starts to boil which is so nice and then you're able to prepare either tea coffee matcha whatever it is that you want so i keep this in my suitcase and i'm able to make my matcha in my hotel room so it just collapses like this and then it comes with its little bag and it keeps it protected so they have tons of different colors in this too i wanted the pink one but the pink one was sold out so i got it in white I also got this portable charger. I am horrible at keeping my portable chargers. I always lose them. I always leave them on the plane. I, they break, whatever. So I got one recently. And I like the fact that this one had the different plugs. So it has the USB-C, it has the USB, and it also has the iPhone plug. So I don't have to worry about having to carry an actual cord with me because I'm so bad at that. Sometimes I will have the charger, but I won't have the cord or I'll have the cord, but I won't have the charger. So it's nice to be able to have this. It actually lasts a pretty long time too. So I can really appreciate that. I haven't had to charge it. And I like that it comes with this little case right here to keep it protected. Speaking of charging, I am going to Europe within the next few weeks and I needed to get another adapter for my electronics. So this is a European plug that has the extension to be able to charge your US devices. It also has the USB-C and the USB right here too, which is very convenient. So, and it's pretty long, it's got a long cord. Staying at my in-laws house, so the bed in the room that I stay in, the nightstand, the plug is a little bit far from the bed. So this is gonna be really nice to be able to just plug everything in. And then also I'll be able to charge different devices at the same time. So I would definitely recommend getting an extension cord like this if you're traveling uh, abroad. Even if you're not traveling international or to Europe, I feel like it would be a good idea to have an extension cord. I have one that's domestic and then now I have one that is for Europe. The last thing I'm going to talk about, this makes me feel like I am very, very much getting older. And this is a heated pad that I have been traveling with lately. I have been working out for the past seven months. And lately I have been going a little bit harder at the gym and I also hurt myself not too long ago. If you saw that video where I told you that I hurt my shoulder. So I have been using a heating pad at home and I've also been taking it on my trips. It just feels so nice after a long day of flying to just put this on your lower back or put this on your abdomen or on your shoulders and just sit there and lay in bed and silence and just relax for a little bit so it comes with this little controller right here it has a heat a heat level and then also timer um, but this is really easy to travel with because it's so so light and compact so all you do is just roll it up like this and then it could fit in your suitcase and that's it so i highly recommend traveling with a heating pad like this because it's just it just makes your experience in a hotel so, so much better. But I think that is it for travel items that I have from Amazon. If you guys want to see what I take for international travel, let me know. I can do one that's specifically for international, especially overseas. And then also, if you guys want to see just like a lifestyle one, just with like stuff that I've gotten from home. I love creating lifestyle videos when I'm not flying too. So if you guys want to see a specific type of video, let me know. It doesn't have to be flight attendant related. I will definitely write it down and add it to my content idea list. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if it's your first time here and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.